Hi, I'm Melissa Shannon from DigitalScrapbookingHQ.com and today I'm going to show you how you can create your own custom Project Life cards in Photoshop Elements. The first thing we'll need to do is load Photoshop Elements and click on the Photo Editor. Then we'll head into the Expert Mode. I'm going to create a 3x4 Project Life card. So I'll click on File, New, blank file and type in the width and height that I want for my project life card and also select 300 pixels per inch. We'll click OK. With this project life card I'm going to set it up as a template to use again in the future. So I'm going to click File, Save As and then save it as a project life 3x4 card. The next thing I'm going to do is set aside some space for my photo and my journaling. Click on the Shape tool and choose a rectangle and draw a rectangle for the space where I want my photo to be in this card. And now I'm going to set aside some space for my journaling. I'm going to click on the Type tool and click and drag to create a text box for my journaling. Then with my Move tool, I'm going to shift click on the two items to align them neatly. Now we can save this as a template for us to use in our project life. When you save a file as a Photoshop document, that means that you'll be able to come back in and edit the text layer by using your Type tool. And you can also edit the photo layer as well. So let's show you how you would use this journaling template. The first thing we want to do is select the area we want for our photo. In this case it's the black shape here. Then we click File, Place and Add and select the photo that we want to use. Make sure Constrain Proportions is checked as you resize your photograph to fit the journaling card. Press enter when you're happy with the size. Now you can clip your photo to fit to your shape layer. Click on the photograph and on your Mac you press Command G and on the PC press Control G. Now you'll notice that this area here is black so I'm just going to click on that and resize it. I can then add the journaling in this area by selecting the box with my type tool and then typing away. When you've finished typing you can select your text and then change the font or change the colour to match your photo. Click the green tick when you're happy with how it's turned out. I'm also going to add some word out. So I'll click File, Place, select my word out. I'm going to rotate and resize this word out to fit. I can use my Move tool to move the type. So once we've got the word art looking how we'd like it to look, we can then save this for printing. File, save as, and then you just go ahead and I'm going to add a date. The Photoshop document can then be printed, file, print, at home. Otherwise, you can go to File, Save As, and then save it as a JPEG. Make sure you've got the maximum resolution. Click OK. And then you can upload that JPEG file to your Photo Processing Center. To reuse this Project Life card, you just open it up 
and then use file place to clip a new photo in and use your type tool to modify the journaling. You could apply this technique to any size or style. For example, go to image, rotate 90 degrees left delete the journaling and draw a new journaling box draw a new journaling box and then you've got a landscape oriented 3x4 card or 4x3 in this case so there you have it a quick and easy way to add a photo some journaling and word art to create your own Project Life printable card. Would you like to learn more about Photoshop Elements? Head over to digitalscrapbookinghq.com for tutorials, workshops and more.